And that brings us to Tucker Bounds, a spokesman for the McCain campaign. Tucker, good to see you. Thanks for joining us. Thank uh, you, Andrew. First of all, let's talk about what happened last night on Sean Hannity's show, where mm -hmm. McCain and Palin were on the program. And for the first time in my recollection, McCain really went after Barack Obama on the subject of William Ayers, the 60s mm -hmm. radical, joining Sarah Palin on this whole subject. Let's play it, and then I'll ask you about it on the other side. What more do you want to know about this relationship? What does it tell you about Barack Obama? tells me again we need to question his judgment and um, you know not only those uh, atrocious activities that Bill Ayers was involved in but the questions need to be asked I believe when did Barack Obama know of his activities uh, we've heard so many conflicting stories and flip-flopped answers about uh, when he knew the guy did he realize that he kicked off his political career in the guy's living room first it was yes and then it was no it, it comes down to again judgment and truthfulness I think they should care about Senator Obama's truthfulness it's about Senator Obama being candid and straightforward with the American people about their relationship. He has dismissed it by saying he was just a guy in the neighborhood. We know it's much more than that. Let's reveal all of the details of that relationship, and then the American people can make a judgment. Tucker, both Obamas have said that this is much ado about nothing. What is your main point here? Uh, what are you trying to do? What are you trying to allege about Barack Obama? Well, our main point is exactly as you just mentioned it, Andrea, it's that they've said it's much ado about nothing, when actually it's much ado about quite something. Um, it's been reported, it's not an alleged tie that he has with this unrepentant terrorist. It's been reported in virtually every major newspaper in America. It's been reported on CNN, it's been reported on Fox. I think even NBC News has had reports about these ties. Um, they're documented, and it is about truthfulness. But it also indicates something larger, which is Barack Obama is willing to say one thing that can completely misrepresents something that's true about himself, just like he does when he tells voters that he hasn't voted in support of higher taxes for people that make just $42,000 a year, or that he's going to provide a middle class tax cut. We can't, we can't take an honest assessment of what he's saying because he so often misrepresents what's actually true. Of course, they uh, counteract that with a lot of facts, and we've done a lot of fact checking mm -hmm. on all of that. But before we go there, let me yeah. ask you to stand by because John McCain has taken to the podium. We want to listen to his speech, and we'll okay. come back on the other side. Let's listen.